see the time because where I've put you guys is where the time usually is so I don't actually know what time it is probably like quarter past six maybe earlier it is ten past six don't tell anybody I checked my phone while I was driving um I just thought um, I did a quick like a little thing last night um, just mentioning um, I'll probably just put it at the start of this like vlog um, just mentioning that um, yeah my vlog that I posted what was it Sunday um, is doing really well already like it's got um, I think as yesterday it was like 35 views which I know it doesn't sound like a lot um, but yeah it's like really just awesome that so is he fucking he's touched my mirror again um so many of you you know want to watch my vlogs and stuff i think as of this morning it's like 38 which i know again doesn't sound like a big number compared to how many like views like other people get but um i'm pretty pretty happy with that at the moment um so i'm just glad you guys are enjoying it so yeah i just thought i would like pop you guys and it's really worked i just got a new car like i think i mentioned in like my vlog or something um and i have like it's a ford fiesta and i have like a little like if anyone knows what a ford fiesta looks like on the inside there's like a little like thing where your clock is and everything and where it tells you what radio you're listening to and stuff and i've just put you guys like right on top of there and it is like perfect like but i'm just a little bit worried if i do any reckless driving that you'll probably like fly off or something um so we'll just see how it goes because I feel like I might have to just get some like double-sided sticky tape to stick you down so that you stay. But that's far. It's not even moving. So and in the morning, it's not exactly like I'm doing any reckless driving because I'm literally just sitting in traffic for like 40 minutes. So anyway, I thought I would just take this time to like have a chat with you guys about like the weekend and stuff. Um, I hope everybody had a good weekend. It's Monday where I am. I don't know when I'm uploading this video, but it'll probably still be a weekday when I put it up. I'm not sure yet, um, but it is Monday morning, hooray. Monday morning traffic is my favorite, lol, not really. Um, and yeah, yesterday, Luke and I went to Supernova, which was really good. We didn't meet anyone this year, just because, um, like last year, we went to the Gold Coast one. Can I make it? Yeah. Um, we went to the Gold Coast one and last year we didn't go to the Gold Coast one, we just went to the Brisbane one. So we usually, we went to Brisbane, Super Nova and Brisbane um, Comic Con. And so we don't normally go to the Gold Coast one because like, it's far away. Well, it's not really far away, but we're just lazy. Um, anyway, and like there's nobody there like that neither of us, like either of us wanted to meet this year. So we just went down there just to like have a good day and there's always like heaps of shit that you can buy and stuff so we just went down there for that um but last year i met neville and i met luna from harry potter if anybody knows who they are probably a lot of you will um so yeah this year we kind of just we went down because we kind of like wanted a weekend like away um because like i've started a new job now and it's been like a few months or whatever and we just kind of wanted some time like to ourselves so that was like mainly the reason are you right like, oh yeah, no, all G. Um, anyway. Yeah, so we kind of just went down there for that. Oh, I love this song. Anyway. Um, yeah, so we kind of just went down there for that reason. Um, and yeah, we had a really good time. We, um, I spent like a ridiculous amount of money, which I always do when I go to Super Dover and Comic Con. Like, it's just expected, um, which is, yeah, not, not great, but I got, I think I posted a picture on Instagram of my jumper. I got like a Harry Potter jumper and it has like a H on the front for like Hogwarts and then like on the back it says like Gryffindor, it's really cool. Um, so if you want to check that out, you can go check out my Instagram. Um, I also got like those little like pop vinyl things are like bubble heads they're not all bubble heads like mine aren't bubble heads but I had Harry and Hermione so I just wanted like to get Ron and so I had all three and then I'll start getting like Snape and like Dumbledore and all the other ones so yeah so I ended up getting Ronnie who else, what else did I get oh Luke got me um like an early birthday present which I think was really cool this car's gonna run me over got me an early birthday present and it was like um they're like shoes 
and they have like the Deathly Hallow like symbol on them, um, which I thought was really cool. So they're like an early birthday present type present, type present, early birthday present type present. Mm. Good from you, Ames. Um, anyway, yeah. And then when we were, I don't know how many of you are like comic booky people or like Marvel people, but when we were in the like we were on our way home because we stayed so that we could like walk to the venue because I was like oh, I don't want to have to drive and like find parking um and like Gold Coast is about an hour and a half away from where we live um and it was like Broad Beach it wasn't surface paradise so it's an extra like 20 minutes to get down there so I was like we'll just go and stay like in Broad Beach and we'll just stay so we can walk there so um it's like a, it was like a five minute walk so we were on our way back and we went to like we were standing at like the lights actually I think we, we went across the road and this guy turned around and like threw his arms out and I was like what, what, what is this and then Luke's freaking out and I'm, I'm like what am I missing here um, and then it turns out it's the guy from I know him from X-Men um, so if any of you like watch it like I've seen any of the X-Men movies or like because Luke and I are like really into like all the Marvels and all that he watches like the DC but I'm not a DC like fan really um but the, it's the guy who plays Iceman from like all like all of the movies like the first well I think he I'm pretty sure he's in all of them yeah because he was in the one like Days of Future Past I think he was in that the one where they go back in time he's in the start of that anyway um yeah, so we and we and I like turned around and I was like looking at him like where do I know this guy from? Like I couldn't put my finger on it. And he was literally standing right next to me. So I'm looking at Luke and he's going, Oh my god, oh my god, and I'm like, you need to like hint at me who this is. So he just went Iceman and I was like, Oh my god, connected the dots, like so funny. Um, because he was we saw in the um like what's it called? What is it called? The um I can't think about what it's called now. The, like the the oh my god it's on the tip of my tongue you know you get the little book and it tells you who's coming there's a fucking name for it i can't even remember what it is sorry about my spell word that was really rude um like the lineup or whatever if you will anyway point being we saw he was there and we were like oh disappointed we should have like booked to see him or got a token or whatever but we just didn't really have the money because it's like 50 dollars to meet them and get a picture like it's a lot of money and then like an extra 50 dollars if you want them to sign something like later that day and like the whole separate like so it's just you kind of find yourself like standing in lines all day so that's why we didn't bother this year because there wasn't anybody there we really 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 wanted to meet but we were a little disappointed when we worked out that he was going and we didn't know so then we, obviously we're standing at the lights back to the lights and we're waiting across the road and he's standing right next to me and he's like talking to some people and Luke and I like whispering to each other like what do we do do we like say something to him or like ask for a photo or like and by the way guys he's like 36 years old I didn't realize he looks 12 like not 12 but he looks like he could be in his 20s still he has like a full beard at the moment and he's like got blonde hair but it's like his beard was like kind of blonde that had like little bits of like kind of like ginger in them I don't know I couldn't really work out I wasn't staring at his face for too long like a creep but yeah basically we were standing there and Luke he's in this t well he was in a tv show um what was the tv show called it's like a tv show that Luke watched I feel like it starts with a D and he's gonna I'm gonna kick myself if I don't remember it Ugh, traffic um I can't remember Kevin Bacon's in it I'm pretty sure So he's in that show. So that's why Luke was like freaking out even more because he's in like two things that he really likes. So that was pretty funny. Um, so then we're like stood there and we're like, what do we do? What do we do? And he's like full on having a conversation with these two guys. I think they were like his, they were like touring him around or whatever. He was, I think pretty sure he was just going to get lunch because then we crossed the road and Luke's like, do we follow him? And I'm like, I don't know. That's kind of creepy, isn't it? Like, because we were like, he's in the middle of a conversation, but we really don't want to, like we want to say something to him. In the end, he, we crossed the road and he went a different way. And I was like, no, it's a little bit weird if we like follow him around, like to wait until he's finished having a conversation. I'm like, if he's having lunch, it's not exactly like that's not rude either. So we should probably just let him do his thing. Um, so yeah, we like walked off and we were like, oh, so upsetting. But at the same time, like, I'm not going to be rude and interrupt someone's conversation just so I can be like, can I get a photo with you? Because I feel like that's probably the most annoying thing about being a celebrity is that when people... I mean, you know, it comes with the territory and like, 
whatever but i just feel like if somebody like came up to me and was like oh excuse me i mean if you were nice about it i guess so i'm saying if you making it sound like that if and if a celebrity was like oh no excuse me i'm in the middle of a conversation you'd be like wow that's really rude so i guess at the same time yeah like but you have to sort of like if you're a celebrity you have to expect it i guess like people doing that but he was in like sounded like he was really talking about something really enthusiastic he was really getting into whatever the hell it was they were talking about um but yeah then later on luke posted it on instagram and was like oh my god we just saw ice man like how cool um and then i tweeted about it um if you guys want to have a look on my twitter that's on my main page if you just press the little bird i think i mentioned that before um but it's amy elizabeth one i think it's 184 if you want to um check it out but oh my god a dog is running by itself oh no oh no i lost dog that's so upsetting i can't even stop and get it because it's on the bridge oh i hope it's okay don't get run over that's really upsetting anyway so <laughs> that took a turn for like a weird thing um yeah so i tweeted about it and then um I like I think I sent two tweets because I couldn't fit everything I wanted to say in like the one tweet um so I tweeted about it and then like I don't even know how long it was like a couple of hours later I came from my phone that he liked both my tweets so I thought that was really cool um of him because he's probably like looking at tweets all day about people meeting him at um supernova and all that sort of stuff so I think that was really cool but I, I freaked out like no John I actually jumped up and down when I saw that he liked my tweet and Luke was like, oh my God, that's really cool. I was like, this is why I do things on Twitter people because like everybody's on Twitter, like, like all the time. Like I find myself sometimes on Twitter, like more than I want anything else just because like everybody's on it. And like people just send, like people tweet the weirdest stuff just because it's so easy to like, you write something and then you like send it off. It's almost like texting people. It's almost like texting the people that you like, like that follow you and stuff. So I just think it's like, yeah, Twitter's always been heaps better. People are like, I've just looked over and this person's like looking at me and they can't like, what the fuck is this crazy person doing? It's like, guys, it's okay, I'm just vlogging. No need to panic. Um, anyway, yeah, so that was my weekend. <laughs> that was just yesterday. Um, we had a good day. I oh, know, we went on Saturday, didn't we? That wasn't yesterday. We went on Saturday. Normally we go to Supernova on Sunday. But this year we went on Saturday. I can't remember what the reason for that was. I think it's just how, what you guys did on your weekend and how it went. And I've just looked, I'm looking at my windows in my car, right? Luke drove my car yesterday and because a bird shat on the back of my window and I was really upset by that. So Luke's cleaned it. But he's also cleaned the front ones and the windscreen wipers must have not been cleaned because now there's like this really disgusting. Oh, my that was my back window. How do I do my front window? people how do i do my front window i feel like calling luke and asking him because now i'm really embarrassed oh my god i don't know how to clean up it's really upsetting i might actually have to call luke because i'm not sure how to fix this now uh, i'm driving a new car guys and i have no idea how it fucking works oh it's still going stop okay it stopped i think it stopped i think i stopped it i'm not 100 percent sure Hold on. I'm waiting for it to like not do anything. Okay. So I worked it out, but I don't know how to do the front ones now. Um I don't know how to fix it. Anyway, I rambled on now about my weekend, so I'm gonna let you guys a go. Um yeah, I'm just on my way to work, so there's not much going on this morning. Except the traffic is moving today, which is like really shocking it's not normally this good normally I'm like stopped all the way up here it usually take it's supposed to only take me 20 minutes to get to work but it usually takes me about 40 minutes to get to work that's like on a good day yeah anyway I'm gonna ring Luke and ask him like, how to fucking get the disgusting streaks off my windows because they're really gross so I'm gonna let you guys go and I will um see you guys real soon again I don't know if I'm gonna like do like a whole week's worth of vlogs and put them up at the same time or what so i don't know i guess it just depends on how much i like vlog during the week but i'll probably only put like one vlog up of the week or whatever um yeah because again my life is not super interesting 
but yeah, it's my birthday next week though, so maybe I'll vlog that day. I don't know. I haven't decided yet. But anyway, yeah, I'll let you guys go and um, cooler beans. I've got to like try and turn you guys off while I'm driving. It's probably a bit dangerous, but nah, it's fine. You're like right there. I just switched my arm out. All right, thanks guys. Bye.